Hello and welcome. Here at the Lobelville SDA Church, we have a passion for the people. Some of us have served as missionaries overseas, and now we are committed to serving in the community. We have done that in many ways, starting with our food pantry project, but we would like to do more, much more. And to do so, we have a dream, a vision, a project, a plan, and I would like to share with you about it today. The Multipurpose Center and Church is a project for the people and by the people. Come with me in a journey and I will share with you something that will warm your heart. Here's where we store our food pantry goods. The fellowship room was getting a little crowded, so we decided to invest in a shed. And it is still a little crowded in here, as you can see. Uh, we use carts to get back and forth. Um, it is a little cumbersome. Having a storage building slash multi-center would do us a great benefit as uh, cut down the time and efficiency of the food pantry and then that way we can serve more of the community. By God's grace we have been holding this food pantry for six, seven plus years. Serving the community unstoppably, even through COVID years, we made sure to provide with the help of donors, faithful donors that have been helping us to keep this in place. It's a blessing to see how many people can benefit from the little that we can gather together. We believe that God has been multiplying and has been blessing this ministry. And that's why we have been so much in need of an expansion so that we can actually reach more and help more with the goods that God has given us. Here's the location where the multi-center will be built. It will be connected to this end of the fellowship room, but will be about 50 feet long and it will provide enough room to effectively have the food pantry and provide a better service for the community. It is called the multi-center because we are hoping to provide multiple different services to our community, whether health, food pantry, and other services. Our church is now heavily involved with the community. We are conducting family events that helps marriages and family relations. These events attract 200 to 300 people, which now requires us to rent outside venues because the seating in our church is limited to 80 persons. That's why we really need to extend the size of our sanctuary. By increasing the size of the sanctuary and building the multi-center would greatly decrease our parking space. The land you see would have to be purchased to be able to expand our parking, which is of much importance to our church and the community visiting us. You know what is interesting about this county, Perry County? It is the highest in unemployment in the entire state of Tennessee. So you can imagine how the, uh, a food pantry or any similar type of ministry would affect such a county as that. Just today in our food pantry, I talked to some of the individuals that have come here and uh, they mentioned that before we came into the area and helped them, they were always struggling with their food and not having enough to eat and so forth. And even the mayor has uh, appreciated what we have done in this area. If the Lord touches your heart to partner with us and providing your generous gifts and donations will help us reach our vision and our dream in serving the community and we thank you in advance. We have shared with you our story, our dream, our vision. We believe with God anything can happen if we unite and set our hearts to do it. And people like you can make a difference. That's why we invite you to partner with us in this project. You can do so by sharing this dream and vision and contributing to make this mission a reality. The community will thank you, we will be blessed, and you will be blessed too. Thank you for embracing this mission and cause. God bless you.